Wedding videos for as low as 100,000 naira? Gusto got you covered. Call 08061344639 or 08064406274. Terms and conditions apply. Peru, Peru, para. I'm not losing my mind though. Anyway, guys, and welcome to Gusto Reaction on Gusto TV. Donny Fesky out here with Lala Daddy, Big Lala number one. You see, you saw one comment on YouTube today. Fesky <laughs> was telling you, Lala oh my number God. one, she'll stop. I say, Yeah, oh, you sabi, you sabi, Fesky, you die on You die on You die on You know, You know, Fesky, you know, my <laughs> Thank you guys for everything you do. We truly, truly. I appreciate you uh we have the peru corona out here in the building milking everything i think the new way now for artists is drop one song once it eats milky die uh, i think sika has inspired a lot of people mm. uh i mean which was what well, a lot of people said eh, after how many after how many <laughs> after but That's, now they don't, they don't have... a lot of people are into it and I, I see some other people trying to attach themselves like uh, they saw the future mm. we'll get to that later mm. but, <laughs> but, <laughs> but yeah i think everybody wants to milk i do as much as for for the record yeah. so uh that one came through uh thanks to bado uh there's no way we always talk about this peru without alvin including olamide in the mix yeah because uh it has been known that okay it was olamide that actually leaked the song mm -hmm. even though fireboy knew that oh it was gonna drop yeah. uh peru fireboy produced by shizzy why is there no shizzy tag on the song well uh shizzy has said he stopped having his tag on songs mm. um yeah he, he i think he came out on twitter to say that okay. because like i i think i've explained on one of the shows before that he's signed he's properly signed to sony oh, okay. and if you're properly signed as a producer to such a big label, label. things are done the okay. right way mm. so if a song is not cleared even by you and you've not sorted the, all the arrangements wow, out that. You're not releasing that song because mm. it's not going up. Even if it goes up, it's going down. Mm. You get so if you're going to mess with a producer like Shizzy, yeah. everything is done the right way. So you don't necessarily have to spoil the song with your tags. Shizzy, the magic ring. Exactly. You don't have to do that anymore mm. if everything is sorted out in the back end. A lot of people do this so that at least even if this artist go drop this record without my consent, yeah, yeah. you're gonna say that I'm a producer. Yeah. Or sometimes even the, the artist oh, business. Yeah, yeah, the artists have don't even shout out, they don't even include it in the artwork mm -hmm. or even put the metadata mm -hmm. when they upload and say, Oh, it was produced by this person. Yeah. So yeah, that's what it is. Also far before this like Peru now that is as big like, oh, who produced this song? Oh, you see it there. Yeah, go on Spotify, show credits. You see it there, she's there. Mm -hmm. uh, and then the remix came with Ed Sheeran. Uh who could have thought that Ed Sheeran was gonna milk like tune a, a, an afrobeat song but then he did one um on own it yeah with stormzy and burner boy uh the video was short and then we saw another acoustic and then the history now starts coming in the brit silver record mm -hmm. probably for this video drops maybe a gold would have been out <laughs> 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 anyway the video is dropping today and then his tour has been going on smoothly and then the record came for fireboy being the first um african to pitch the highest and fastest debut on the billboard mm. hot 100 mm. one month and two weeks that's mm. about six weeks to number 79 mm. uh you also got this one number one shazam song in london in the uk in the uk yeah in the mm -hmm. uk and then empire came again and said we are not tired even despite the fact that fireboy and lambdina had um, back and forth that he said he was going to drop uh, another single, single. in march mm -hmm. and everything mm -hmm. after that empire came fireboy 21 savage blast peru friday Hmm. and now the song is out hmm. what are your thoughts on this well um yesterday when we did what to expect yeah uh and i said okay a trapper and a rapper mm. that because historically there's this guy these american rappers mm. they find it difficult to flow well i mean f for us to really enjoy them yeah they find it difficult to flow well on afro beat records mm. it's not the first time Mm. The bad has gone through that route. Yeah. The uh the David has gone David through that route. Yeah. Even Wiz has gone through that route. There's always a difficulty for these guys to flow. It was always a worry for me. Mm. And bam, today happened and listen to the song. The person who surprised me the most is the chopper in the house. <laughs> 21 Savage. I feel like if 21 Savage says they I want to do a full beats, yeah. he'll kill it. Because he had to be different mm. on the record. He, the beats are different. Yeah. The production is different. It's yeah. not what they are used to. Mm -hmm. But he was able to do so well, Bro. give it a different kind of vibe. Okay. If there was a, an actual 21 Savage 
version of fireboy i bet you i will enjoy listening to it it just take, took me back to something unique that buju did mm. buju came in and messed messed everywhere yeah, yeah. 21 savage also came in and messed everywhere and unfortunately for blast blast it could not keep up because <laughs> the oh b oh b yeah unfortunately for blast he could not keep up he had to be he reverted to what we always feared about our kata people mm. when they jump on Afrobeat. on Afrobeat records and that's exactly what blast did it's not his style we know he's a rapper yeah. but you need to be different come on if you want to jump on Afrobeat, you need to be unique you can't do it like your regular record mm. 24 21 savage showed that and i'm really impressed i kind of like what he bought on board uh, for the mix, he, he made this remix a special one. Ah. I think that's good. So, if you were part of the Fireboy team and the Empire team, mm. would you have removed a blast on this? I'm not going to let Danu 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 Danu. I'll come out and say, Oh, blast, go and see that. We'll, put, we'll find another <laughs> alphabet that is to jump on you. But mm. there must be a reason why they put blast in there. Mm. Um, I never heard of him f- f- until today. Yeah, until, so, until, 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 until this one. Yeah, until this one. So, perhaps a bit of what's it called Empire. for him as well. Uh, maybe empire connect and a bit of publicity for him as well which, which is not bad uh but all in all i think uh they tried on this record so what what are the um feats that this record in the um, in the u.s market would bring to fireboy well i don't think it's actually this remix that they that they have in mind mm. i think the made is even to get more attention on the original in the u.s okay. and i think it's it, they're going to use it to push uh fireboy as a brand mm. peru as a song further so that you can climb higher on the billboard hot mm. 100 mm. this will get a lot of impressions and yeah. tra- the way it's even structured 21 savage and blast are made main artists on the record yeah so if you go on 21 savage uh apple music you see, you see on his profile mm. all people who follow 21 savage will get the notification on mm. spotify that yes he has a new record mm. but in actual sense is a featured guy on there, but the way the, the makeup of the song went, mm. they are making use of all the followers of Trinidad Savage and all the followers of Blast. Blast yeah. for, for that one. Mm. Uh, so for Fireboy, uh, Peru, which other region should they go to? Now they've done UK, that's, they've that's even if I agree that they should start going different regions. Um, I think, I don't should know. Maybe the end of Peru for them. No, no, it can't be the end of Peru. Peru should be heard. No. <laughs> <laughs> it can't be the end of Peru. Regards, regards to the remixes. I think people should not follow the crowd and start doing this remix of a thing. Mm. They need to be different. Uh, there's, there needs to be a different approach. Yeah. Uh, it can't just be this and everyone starts doing it. But, but that being said, this was a good attempt. Mm. If I would, so if they still want to do remix and they want me to suggest, mm. I said they should go to uh, what's it called? Peru is in South America get some latino guys on there yeah uh, who like uh, even some peruvian uh, yeah. artists on there and let me use that this i don't know why i'm saying this word again uh, and this is because is a uh, what's her name <laughs> Oloi Bimzi, that i said this word today let them go to south america and f shit up <laughs> anyways guys before we go lastly it's a hit or it means for you and then your rating i think it's a good one i say it's a hit um I, I yeah, Twenty One Savage. I, I was deeply impressed and I liked it. So uh, I feel yes, people would like this as well. Mm. Although I see a few comments around, nah, 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 I don't think so. I think this is mm-hmm. a, this is a very good attempt by um, Empire to 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 push the Peru uh, in, industry. So yeah, what would you rate it? Uh, this is good. I think it's a seven over ten song. Alrighty, seven over ten is uh, not a means for Big Lala. So guys, let us know what you think would deliver the most for our people from the US. Is it Blast? Or is it 21 Savage? Drop your comments down below. And if you are yet to listen, go listen and then come back to drop your comment. To we'll catch you on the next one. Gusto Reactions on Gusto TV. Peace out.